Okay, weather-wise this morning, 7 a.m. temperatures expected to uh, be in the upper 30s. Even some spots are in the 40s, and even some of the northern counties are actually a little bit colder. Uh, we're down close to freezing in some of the, the north and northeastern areas. A mix of sun and clouds at 8 o'clock. Some of the eastern spots will have a little more cloud cover to start the day. Kind of breezy today, too. The winds will be up around 10, 15 miles an hour, and most of us are in the mid-40s. Pretty sunrise, though, this morning in West Alabama, where skies are clear. Tuscaloosa Sky Cam, and we're at 37 degrees, so it's a pretty cold morning in a lot of locations. The metro area a little bit warmer, but 37 in Anniston, down to 32. Gadsden, 33 in Coleman, 30 in Haleyville. Pollen count, as you would expect. Obviously, tree pollen is the, uh, is the worst right now. Today, not too bad, but Monday and Tuesday, it'll come up and then we'll get some showers later in the day Tuesday and into Wednesday and so that should help bring it back down a little bit by the middle of the week. All right, here's a look at the forecast and so some mid 40s at 9 mid 50s by noon and we'll likely have a, a little more sunshine once we get into the afternoon hours uh, for those areas that are seeing some clouds this morning and then breezy in mid 60s by 3 o'clock and down into the mid 50s at 9. All right, so jumping ahead to Tuesday, that's when we're going to start to see the chance for some showers returning to the area. Really Tuesday kind of uh, during the, uh, the morning hours for the northwest and there'll be some scattered showers at times Tuesday and even into Wednesday and then it looks like we'll see the threat for some thunderstorms and maybe even some stronger thunderstorms storms coming in by Thursday afternoon and into Thursday night. So rain chances coming up again toward the middle and end of next week. But look at these temperatures today will be in the mid 60s, 70 tomorrow, and then the forecast gets unsettled by the middle of the week. Stay with us here watching WVTM 13 News.